What you doing? Is that an energy drink? You got no energy? What's the time? Ten to four. And you ain't got no energy. Oh, no. Well, we've come out a bit lighter today. Um, obviously, with the being Saturday and the weather, it's been hot, damn hot. So uh, we plan to come up and do an evening shift. And uh, yeah, late afternoon evening shift. And poor Kimmy, now it's come. Is no. we should have come up this morning. Should have come up this morning. <laughs> to be fair, she wouldn't go this morning either. Oh. The sun is shining and the shades are back on. See you in a minute. So our top bed is uh, still got nothing growing in it um, after we got the garlic out and this one over here where the broad beans were and obviously our onions is now almost gone. Mm, where have the broad beans gone? Well here we go, look at this. Look. So uh, Bod's allotment, he was up here uh, late one evening and he was watering and he looked across and you know we had the great big, um, I'll show you, it's there, it's there, it's there, around them. The deer had somehow I'd managed to um, hoist it up one side, he got inside and was having a lovely feast, trampled it all down and um, yeah. I just hope he's got belly ache. I really do. So that's like I say, you're just pulling your hair up. You know, they've been in since um we planted them in November. So they uh, they've gone for a really rough winter. Um, you know, a lot of heavy rain. Uh, snowed on, come up here, pinned them back up, got them back up, looked after them, monitored the the black fly on them. Looking good. We're starting to pick some beans off them, and then at the very last minute, Mr. Deer comes along and completely wrecks it. But no, uh, we still got the people up here. Oh, the lovely deer! Oh, the lovely. Yeah, we'll take them home then, because I don't want them. Unbelievable! Unbelievable! He's just going on about the uh, the pots being all spidery, and she wants them kept away from her. Um, yeah, these are the ones that uh, we got from the other. Allotment, um, what we found in a, well we sort of found everywhere didn't we, in the bushes and that, um, so I've kept them. So they're probably your two of your biggest. Uh, he being, yeah, yeah, yeah. No. It's all right. So put them down on the floor when you're done. So if I leave you running with a bit of music, watch Kim pot up. Well, we just they don't know how to do it. Well, they, I know, but they don't know how to see it, do it your way. You don't pot up like everyone else, I'm sure. Uh, that'll be your next week. All right, probably be set. Home bed. It's going to be on speedy up. That's They're not going to hear you talking because it's going to be music playing. That's good. Alright?
was potting up I uh, come in here and done Operation String Up. Uh, as I said I've run a, run a cane across the top just tie wrapped him in and uh, just cross, crisscrossed my string quite a few times and now I'll just train him to come up and over so uh, we get this, uh, this this whole side of the roof filled. Have a nice canopy of, uh, of green and hopefully have the cucumbers cucumbers then dangling down. Hmm. Boy, it's hot. Uh, someone mentioned in the comments uh, reference how do we make the. Sorry, I forgot your name, but your your little uh, question to be on the screen. Um, this is just old um, water tube that you can get from uh, the likes of Screw Fix and any uh, builders merchants. Um, comes on a on a big roll. Um, don't go for the. There's no need to go for the really big thick stuff. Uh, we go on for the, the smallest. I can't remember. I think it's okay. I mean, 18 mil or 20 odd mil or something. Um, uh, I can't remember if it's you get 100 meters or 50 meters of it. Uh, it's not that expensive. Uh, then you just um, cut it into the desired lengths you want. Uh, once you've got one, and then just copy that length it's really easy to do just cut them be careful though uh, use a sharp knife and don't lacerate through your leg like I did and the netting um, we usually get a lot of the black stuff from garden centers and um, it's pretty expensive so the cheaper alternative which is a lot better is this is um, this is debris netting uh, which you'll find on scaffolds um, again it's uh, two meters uh, width and it comes on a 50 meter roll and it's somewhere in a region of between 20 and 25 pound and you can get that off of um, Amazon Amazon Yeah, uh, and obviously Cut that with the span you want um, I always use a uh, stake at the end uh, Preferably a metal one. Uh, so when you've got your hoops in uh, Stake there stake down the other end the old trusty tie wrap, cable tie, whatever you want to call them. Um, I'm, I've got all these off Kev, me mate, Kev. So uh, it's pretty inexpensive for me. And then uh, throw it across and tie wrap it on. And then the excess just tie to your pole. But that's the way you do it. Uh, yeah. And obviously what's nice about them is um, you can pull them up like that to access your plants. Are you in? Buckle up, safety first. Oh. As a uh, as an outro, we thought we'd do something slightly different today in that um, we'll take the scenic route out of our allotment. So, um, let's do this.
and on the right hand side is uh, Mal and Kim's allotment. And on the left hand side is oh, Spod. There's the uh, Queen's allotment. You can That's see, see the, uh, the Queen in residence flag flying. She, um, she comes down here quite regular, old, uh, old Lizzie. The Queen's flag. Lovely down here, my bird. That's a nice one. I think that's a nice one. I think the best one on here is this one we're talking now. That's beautiful. Look at the bath, this is uh, where you can come and have a bath. <laughs> it quite often. How rude! <coughs> rude. So, and that is the, uh, the exit out. So, until next time, see you later! Oh, is that it? Yeah. <laughs> you got some.